okay, you're setting up a fire stick for someone else and you want to skip the equipment control part. In the next few minutes, we'll show you how. So you can set it up, then hand it to them and tell them when they get home, just enter their Wi-Fi credentials and go to this time that we're showing on the video screen and they'll be able to set up the rest. Welcome to the Cord Cutters community, where we help you cut the high cost of cable and satellite and realize your stream dream. We bring you advice, reviews, and easy to understand and follow how-tos like this one right here. First, go ahead and log into your Wi-Fi, enter your credentials, and when you get to the equipment control part, we'll help you get around that. All right, so you entered your Wi-Fi, you entered your credentials for your Amazon account, and you hit the like and subscribe, right? Okay, so now we're all ready to move on. So please like and subscribe my video so we can keep uploading more of these cord cutting videos. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and click no on the parental controls. You can do whatever you like there on yours. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and show you how to set up the remote without having to log into what kind of TV or audio receiver or soundbar or whatever you have, okay? And the reason you might wanna do this is maybe you're setting up a fire stick for a friend. Maybe you're doing it for your parents from your house and then you're gonna take it over to their house. And, uh, oh, there's, there's a lot of reasons why you might wanna do this, okay? So we scroll all the way down to the bottom where it says brand not listed. So we're gonna go ahead and click on that. And then it's gonna ask you, to turn up the volume up and down. So you go ahead and, and do that on your remote. And then click next. Okay, volume up, volume down. Did you hear anything? This is where you wanna click no. Okay, so once you click no, you tell it that I wanna just use my TV only, okay? So you click on that. So now it's gonna have us attempt to set up the remote anyways. As you see there, attempt two of six is what's coming up next. So we gotta go through the six times of telling it no. So go ahead and click the volume up, volume down, and then no. And then the volume up, volume down again, and then no. So you get the idea. So after you did that six times, it gets to this point, and what we're going to do now is go to skip. And now your remote is set up to work on your Fire Stick without doing the audio and video on your current setup. So if you wanna to go to another place and set it up again, we're gonna show you how to do that right now. So first of all on this, I'm gonna click no thanks. Click on that. And no thanks again on the streaming services. Not now for kids. So now we're at the home screen and say you're at your parents' house and you now wanna set up the fire stick on their TV to work their sound bar, et cetera. We go over to settings. and then you would go over to equipment control. So you click on that, and now it's where you go ahead and go through everything and add your TV and add your sound bar, et cetera, et cetera. So just click on add equipment, you would click on add TV, and then you would sync your remote to your TV. And that's how it's done. That's how to set up your remote and skipping all the uh, audio video setup. If this video helped you out, please hit the like and subscribe. Share this with your friends so they too can save a whole lot of money on the high cost of cable and satellite TV. It's time to cut the cord, people, and join the Cord Cutters community. This is Ray. Thank you so, so much for coming on by, and we'll talk to you again very, very soon.